Holy smokes, ladies and gentlemen, uh, we're going to be uploading YouTube thumbnails directly from our phone or iPad. Now I am on the Brian G. Johnson iPad, as you can see, and I'm going to show you just how easy it is to, yes, upload a thumbnail from your phone, from your iPad, any iOS device, straight to your latest YouTube video. And with that, we can really manage our channel entirely from our phone. We can change channel art, we can create channel art on our iPad or iPhone, we can upload it, we can access stats by checking out the Studio app, which I'm opening up now. I'll do a, a video on Studio in the future. I love this app. Uh, but this isn't about Studio. This is about one of the limitations of Studio. Because for whatever reason, you're, you are not able to upload a YouTube thumbnail with the Studio app. You can't change it. You can change a lot of things. You can add a description to your video. You can add tags. You can change your titles. You can access analytics. But nope, you can't upload a thumbnail. So how do you do it? First, you're going to want to access and download the Chrome browser. So download Chrome. I've done that now. I'll open up Chrome. And uh, you'll see that actually, oh, and it, it's, it, it knows that I like to be on the desktop. So notice it says we've got this big blue bar. It says we've redirected you to the desktop website. Return to YouTube mobile. Now, there's a good chance if you don't use Chrome a lot or if you're using it and you're usually on mobile, like if you notice the address, it's m.youtube.com. Well, that's not really what I want because if I'm on mobile, I can't upload a thumbnail. So what are we gonna do? Well, first, you're gonna log in and access your channel. So make sure you log in, click on the, uh, the avatar icon, and you can see there's my channel, and it, it looks like I'm on mobile, which isn't really gonna work for me, and I won't be able to upload that, that thumbnail. So what do we do? Notice next to the search icon in the upper right-hand corner, those three dots, if I click that, we get settings, terms, feedback, help, and desktop. Awesome. Click on desktop, and now we've accessed desktop, and it looks exactly like the desktop version of YouTube. I'm going to select my um, icon in the upper right-hand corner, Creator Studio, and that's where I want to go first. I'm going to click on Creator Studio. And the next thing I want to do from Creator Studio is I want to basically just uh, access uh, a video. Let's say here's a, a, a video for Trust Funnel Academy, one of my most recent training videos for my coaching clients. If I click on Edit, you'll see that I de indeed can upload an us, uh, a custom thumbnail. And that's just how easy it is. So you get Chrome, you access... Uh, the settings and you select desktop and you're good to go. Now, if you're interested in thumbnails, I have got a number of videos that I'm going to recommend you check out. In fact, the one that I think you should check out right now is on, on my homepage and it's go ahead, punk, click this. Now, this is, I think it's, yeah, 15 minute video and it goes over the science and psychological draw of a well optimized thumbnail. If you're looking for inspiration for video thumbnails, if you're looking for video thumbnails idea, ideas, well, check out that video now. I'll go ahead and click that. And what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to link, link to that uh, video in the YouTube card. So check out that video and you'll be able to gain some insights that were taken directly from YouTube on how to create and optimize uh, your YouTube thumbnails. So check that out.
Ryan G. Johnson!